Ngai Sahai. Ngai Sahai, Absu here, back for another video. Welcome back to Baldur's Gate 3. Um, as you can see, things look a little different. That's because the poll results came in basically saying I should go back to before I got fucked up by them. Get the Yankee. So now I'm not now I have a chance to just not go to the mountain pass. I'm gonna lose all that progress on that I did with Lazel and all that, but honestly, I'd rather do everything on this map first before I go there. If you must, Astaria, but give me so much as a hungry look, and I'll drive a stake through your heart. Mm. I do so very like spicy food. So this time I'm gonna go down this way, like I did in my dark timeline video, and I'm going to try to recruit Carlac and all that. You know? Strange. It looks healthy, but it's stone dead. <laughs> Who cares about some pig? It's dead. Let's go. We know you. You drank it. Oh shit. Okay. Let's see. So, we're gonna try this again, <laughs> but we're gonna be slightly less powerful. Sneak attack. And that means right now we don't have any illithid powers or anything, so I'm gonna try to avoid that this time because if anyone's gonna do it, it's gonna be uh, a Starian. He has cleave, right? Yeah, she does have cleave. Okay, now cleave their ass. Why don't I have an action? What's happening here? It's not her turn. Okay, well, he needs to die, then. Okay, good. Victory now, awaits. cleave their ass in twain, bitch. I guess we're only gonna be able to do it to two of them. Wait, what the hell? Why do I feel like I'm not hitting any of them? Bitch, just... Move. Okay, please. At least hit these two. Why does he not have an action?
There we go. Wonder if the gods are watching me. This must be where the gnolls attacked. The creature's eyes roll back in its head, equal parts bliss she'd eaten. Come, see, oh. my flesh becomes new flesh. Oh my god, it's speaking to me. I just noticed that. You hear what comes next before you see it. The sharp snapping of bones and a yelp of pain as her body starts to twist and undulate. The hyena moans softly as its body contorts, ribs cracking and flesh tearing. All right, um, destroy the abomination, please. You land a swift strike against her skull. She yelps, then goes still. Whatever horrific creature was growing inside the hyena dies along with her. Ah. All right, let us destroy these things. Oh, I don't have my crossbow with him, so. Jesus. Hmm. Oh, he attacked twice. Death is but a word away. That one still lives. How the fuck? There we go. Overrun with gnolls. No wonder they're leaping from hyenas left and right. Let's not stand around. I can smell spilled blood a mile away. Oh, and thank God, I don't have to deal with that bug anymore. With with Gale.
Whatever killed those gnolls must be nearby. Careful. Alright, so I want to long rest. Wait, do I want to long rest? Hmm? I just want to go to camp for a second. Because yeah, I think I want to have... I want to have Will here. Light on my feet. Well met. I think I'll remove Lazel. Speak. Because we had a lot of time with her last time. But that means I also need all this shit. That she has right now. That's good for now. Speak. Wait for me in camp. Chuck, you believe you can survive without me? I'm not arguing. Remain here. As you say, do not keep me waiting. Well met. I'd like you to join me. That's the spirit. All right, let's level this bitch up. Defender of the people. I guess Hellish Rebuke. Agonizing Blast and Ooh, Beast Speech. That's cool. So Warlocks could just talk to animals. When you hit a creature with Eldritch Blast, you can push the creature up to 4.5 meters away. Alright.
Wait, madness. Make them attack the creature closest to them, other than you, even if it's allied. School. Boom. Hacked of the chain makes it so that I can summon something. Hacked of the blade. You can summon a packed weapon or bind the one that you're wielding, making it magical. I think packed of the blade would be would make sense for him. Hacked of the tome, your patron grants you a grimoire. Which lets you cast Guidance Vic Okay, no. I'm gonna do Pact of the Blade. Bind Pact Weapon. Bind to your main hand weapon. Its damage becomes magical. You cannot drop or throw it, and you become proficient with it if you weren't already. Oh. Summon a weapon to your hand. It uses your Spellcaster Ability Modifier, and its damage is magical. That's fun. So is he able to equip this? Because that would be cool. If he'll be proficient, right? So like, if he does this, right? Bind Packed Weapon. Bind to your main hand weapon. Its damage becomes magical. You cannot drop or throw it, and you can become and you become proficient with it if you weren't already. Nice. Alright, so now I could make Will into some weird uh tanky warrior warlock. Okay, so he needs armor. Do we have any? Not sure what happened to it. Is she still wearing it? Oh my gosh, she is. Mm, approvals here. Speak. Whatever, it's fine. I can just get him armor later. Looking ahead. With haste. Everything's fine now. Let me just double check. Well met. Okay. You are now going to go to the we're gonna leave camp. Was a time I tussled with hill giants without breaking a sweat. Now, a mere werebear could swat me halfway to arm. Strange things are happening to us. What festers in our minds may well impel our bodies. Interesting.
The corpse does not respond. I just want to activate that real quick. I'd give it a bloody good fight, that's for sure. <laughs> Only thing you give a dragon is a bad If you want to go poking around in the cellar, be my guest. Plug your nose first, though. Why? What's down there? Corpse. Half right to mush. Must have been down there a ten day or more. This is a nice place to hole up. What is it? It was a toll house. By the time we arrived, it was more like a slaughterhouse. There's more monsters than coin moving down this road. Okay. Who, who's there? Please, keep your distance. You're welcome to shelter here, but we've grave injuries to tend to. Who or what attacked you? A devil. The most deadly foe we've yet encountered. We are paladins of Tyr, Lord of Justice. He sent us after an infernal being, straight out of the Nine Hells, hiding in the form of a one-horned tiefling. One horn? Then you mean Karlak, Archdevil's bootlicker. You know her, which means you know what the Fiend is capable of. She slaughtered countless refugees fleeing the Absolute. Yesterday, she butchered an entire family without mercy. Oh my god. We were lucky to survive our encounter with her. Where is this devil? She ran toward the river when she saw we were merely wounded, not dead. Down the hill from here. She must pay for her crimes. If you capture her, you will have served Tyr where we could not. This is the sword of justice, blessed by Tyr. I've wielded it since I swore my oath. It's all I have, but it's yours if you stop her. Bring me her head, and Tyr will consider her crimes repaid. I'll think about it. May the just God guide you. Okay, finally, let's sell all the shit to this bitch. Need any supplies? We've fewer mouths to feed now. How many did you lose? Two. Both stalwarts of Tear. Sworn to uphold justice. What happened to you? The Lord of Justice sent us after a devil haunting this area. We squared off against her. We lost. Talk to Anders if you want the details. I don't have it in me to recount the horror. Let's see what you have to trade. All right, I want that. I want all of these. I want all of these. I want all your supplies. I want these. Let's 
let's take all of these, and I'll take all your gold. And I am going to now sell literally everything. And the clothing to the camp. Well, I can give him... Ooh. Yeah, I can give him the Givanki plate. Make him tank here. Okay, let's remove the scrolls of Revivify. Thousand two forty nine. I think that's it. Should be it. Give him this shit. Interesting clothing for him. Now let's talk to this dead guy. Corpse regards you lifelessly. How did you die? Sarius brute destroyed me. Zarius brute. Oh, so are we talking about Carlac? Who are you? Wait, you're a servant of the infernal elves. What the fuck? 
The pact. The pact. A pact. Which devil did you deal with? Fallen. A pact, Tazario. Why would you sign a pact with a devil? Our the spell's power wanes. You can ask no more All right, questions. so we could, we we all know that these people are followers of Zario because that that seems to be uh, what that guy just said. Well met. Hmm. Well, <laughs> drop the act. You're no paladin. You serve the arch devil Zario. <laughs> I just spoke to that guy, so let's see. Well, you're no paladin. You serve the arch devil Zario. Lock the doors. First I was burned within an inch of my life, and now I'm stuck playing pantomime. I can't take it anymore. Karlak is going back to Avernus, and if she won't go quietly, she dies. It looks like I'll have to kill you first, which I quite look forward to. Bye-bye. Really? Okay, you want to die. That's fine. You really think you're scary at all, bitch? rebuke that's fun <laughs> what happens to the, oh, the other bitches over here That door real quick. Rough tempest I will raise. Good damage, all right. We. We. What in the fuck? Holy shit, what? Wait, why is he so strong? I didn't know he was this strong. I saved, right? Please tell me I saved. Okay, good. I can hit both of them. Problem is, it's gonna hit him as well. There we go. Huh? huh? What? Are you fucking kidding me? Let's rebuke. Oh, he leveled up. Okay. Please, 
make him prone on this 10%. Oh my god. Why is he so OP? <laughs> Beast upon him. Now please. Why is he so OP? Jesus. I'm gonna have to redo this. Oh my god. Oh my god. Well, that fucking hurt. I think successful. Sneak attack range. He missed! What the fuck? Oh my god. Alright, so that went bad. Let's try this again. All right, so I'm gonna turn off group mode. Put you here. Where am I needed? I am going to do not proficient with equipped armor. Oh, so he's not able to cast. All right. Even though this is medium, he's not proficient with medium. All right. What about this? You're proficient with that? Okay, then you wear that. <laughs> Jesus Christ. It's horrifying. Okay, so now... Armor of Agathus. Alright. You'll be here. Not as bad as it could have. Lost in thought. Close the door real quick. Most excellent. All right. Let's try this again. And if I fail this again, I'm just gonna go talk to Carla. <laughs> the doors first I was burned within an inch of my life Karlak is going all right then let us go drain him of his blood Sneak attack melee. Ooh, good job. That's nice. 
some good damage. We need to kill this guy immediately, so... I need a good single target spell. No, I'm just gonna fucking turn into an animal. Now you. Okay, good damage. Close this door. And block the door. And you, please hit him. You missed! How could you miss? We can kill Anders immediately. Oh my god. Relax, bitch. Hellish Rebuke, do it. He's dead. The monster is dead. Alright, now. Sword of Justice, Tears Protection. <sighs> I feel like this is gonna be cool. Okay, you just pick this up real quick. Get up, damn it. Uh. Alright. Find a way forward. Inciting howl. Swords meet sorcery. With ease. This is my time. Oh my god. Oh my god, no. Why are they so OP? Okay, please save the day here. Throw a damn potion. Greater healing. Nice. Good healing. Oh my god. Auntie Ethel actually helped us there. Now they 
see me? Victor's path. Okay, please kill this bitch. Why do you keep missing? You've you've missed every single time. You have never hit at all. What is the issue here? God. Oh my god, she needs to stop. Oh my god, they're literally just so lucky. Where did you go? She's looking for him. Detecting presence, this bitch. Oh my god, he's so good. Sneak attack range. He's so good at hiding. I love it. No choice but to keep going. Please hit her. How? My God, you just you just keep failing. You keep failing. Thank you. Look at that. Look how much damage he can do if he just hits. Thank God. Okay, we just need one more. One more. Just like old times. Life comes easy these days. Critical miss. God. This is my time. Okay, it's time to heal this guy. No, no, no. Here we go. Allow me to demonstrate with haste. Nice damage, okay. Please, Watch hit her. Man. Bruh. Asterion is so good. Oh my god. <laughs> Wait, it just landed. What the fuck? What do you mean, target is too far? Just fight her. Boom! Finally. Ever heard of a vampire called Casador? Well, I don't think so. Why? Friend of the Patriarch of the Tsar family. 
nasty fellow, if the histories are accurate. I imagine they are. Well, I got my Albor <laughs> Al Albert egg back. And I got three scrolls of Revivify. Ah, uh, I need to rest. Sunset can't come quickly enough. Have to keep going. Well, that went well. He's gonna go die because they're stupid. Oh, soul point. Let's go pick that up. And now let's go talk to Carlyke before I end this episode. Oh, another. Okay, well, I've already talked to this guy. Let me just skip through this one. Drop the key. Oh, there's the key. Let's save first of all. All right. Now. Oh, there she is. We're all injured here. One horn, the stink of Avernus, Advocatus Diaboli. <sighs> well, I'll be God's damned. The Blade of Frontiers. Thought I'd shaken you for good. That'll teach me to underestimate you. You're the devil we've been hunting, Carlac. Carlac, right? Bloody right. An honor to be chased by the Blade of Frontiers. But I... Ugh! A great huh? heat roars through you. Her heat. Fiery as the hells, then you're lost in visions of demonic armies as you tear through a landscape of fire and blood, the blood war. You saw it from above as the Nautiloid passed through Avernus. This woman was on the front line. What's that? Evidence. Proof that you're a devil. A gladiator in the Archdevil Zariel's army. I can explain, but it's a whole situation. If you just hear me out... Another vision. Karlak's blade raised, slicing through devils. Zariel's servants, as her eyes dart around, seeking escape. Her rage and desperation seep into you. She is a victim of the Blood War, not an agent of it. She's trying to trick us. Don't believe her lies. You saw the truth. I never wanted to serve Zariel. I was enlisted in her army against my will. Forced to fight, and fight I did. When I saw an opportunity to get away, I took it. Finally home. Or near it anyway. You served her. That's enough to damn you. Is it, really? Stand down, Will. You saw what I saw. You don't know what you're saying. You're asking me to trust a devil.
You saw her thoughts. She poses no danger to the Sword Coast. You know monsters, right? Better than anyone. Everyone approves. Look into my eyes. Can't you see I'm not what you think? Shit. You really are no devil, are you? I've... I've been deceived. Oh, thank the gods. Thought I was gonna have to take your head. <laughs> you really? would have died in the attempt. But there have been enough threats today. Truce then, eh? Aye. Truce. I'm Karlak. But you already knew that. And you are... I'm Abzu. Well met, soldier. Nice to meet a friendly around here. It's been tough going so far. I may not be a devil, but I can put the Blade's reputation to work. How would you feel about helping me kill some evil bastards? Little background, if your moral compass needs something to point at. You already know I fought in the Blood War. I was good. Really good. It turns out, I've got a knack for killing demons. That made me a valuable asset. Zariel, the archdevil herself, made me as her personal attack dog. I played along until I could get the fuck out of there. But devils don't like to lose their assets. <laughs> Zariel liked it so little. She sent a bunch of goons, so-called paladins of tear, to take me back. Problem is, I'm not going. <laughs> I have good news for you then. I already killed the paladins you say were hunting you. You did? That's incredible! You ought to let me return the favor. We can team up, evict this parasite, and then take Faerun by the short hairs. Sound good? Alright. Welcome to the team. Way! Now we're talking! Uh, hang on, though. Looks like you've got enough backup at your side. Not sure there's room for me. I'll catch up with you when it's time to camp for now. But don't get to any of the fun stuff without me. Got it? <laughs> Storian, how is the rat diet going? It may soon come to an end if you don't shut your mouth. <laughs> You've been witness to a pantomime, I'm sorry to say. And I've played my part all too poorly. He looks really good with the Starian clothes. Someone set you on Car Carlac's tail. I'd like to know who this source of yours is. I can say only this. Karlak's not the only one who's had a villain's knife held to their throats. <sighs> Gods, what now? <laughs> Do you have a tax collector on your tail? <laughs> You're closer than you think. One night soon when we make camp, the veil will be lifted, and I'll pay my penance. Uh-oh. So that's gonna happen now? Penance? Should I be worried? You're not in any danger, I promise. I can't say the same about me. Well met. I'm feeling a bit parched and peckish. Me too. Keep an eye out for any passing vagrants. <laughs> I'm afraid you'll have to content yourself with vagrant chickens. Alright, well this is a good time to end the episode. <laughs> we met Carlac, and we're gonna go to camp. In the next episode, we're probably gonna... I'm probably gonna keep Will. But, um, we're gonna go to the goblin camp, I believe. Something like that, probably. See ya there. See ya.